over from here. Tell us what our weather's looking like today. Well, this morning is fine. No problems out there, but later on this afternoon and evening, we're expecting strong to severe thunderstorms. You need to be weather aware today. We're talking damaging winds, heavy rain and hail with these thunderstorms, and some of the winds can be really strong across northeastern part of Alabama. How about a gorgeous sunrise? Look at this, this is from the Talladega Super Speedway camera, though. Pretty sky out there. The sun just coming up. Really nice start to your day over in Dega. 71 degrees. The dew point 70. Sure, it's quite muggy out there this morning. We're at 71 also in Anderson back to Gadsden 70 right now. Asheville to Jasper are cool spots. Birmingham at 78 degrees with 77 in Fayette. Tuscaloosa, Alabaster so there at 75 and looking ahead throughout the morning. No problems out there till later on this afternoon. That's when we'll see those storms coming in. But before they get here, though, we are really going to heat up 94, 5, 6, 7 degrees for our high temperatures today. Very hot out there like yesterday. The heat index running about 107 to 111 across much of the area. So we do have heat advisories and excessive heat warm warnings in effect. Heat advisory to the northern part of central Alabama, excessive heat warning to the south. The difference is advisory 105 to 110 heat index, excessive heat warning. It's 110 greater, 110 greater. So looking at the morning, really nothing more than a few of the birds roosting. They're coming out of Pickens County as we typically see those roost rings. But outside of that, though, mostly clear some of those high clouds coming in. Watching this front and the disturbance behind it, both of them are headed our way. Already severe weather breaking out across Arkansas this morning. A sign of things to come for us later today as the systems move on into our area and there is a level three enhanced risk over the northeastern Alabama level two for much of the rest of central Alabama better chance for 70 mile per hour winds Huntsville Hartsville Hartsville Coleman area Gats and Anderson for Payne area here in Birmingham back to Tuscaloosa and back to Sylacauga we are looking at maybe some winds gusting up to 60 miles per hour at times today with these thunderstorms and you'll notice they start developing in the northwestern part of the state here by lunchtime today two three o'clock into the Birmingham area, though, back toward Gadsden, all the way back to Tuscaloosa area, sweeping through the region here by, say, 5 o'clock with a few lingering storms behind it. They'll clear out by 7 o'clock to 11 o'clock tonight. Things are looking pretty good. By tomorrow morning, we initially start quiet, but then right around 7 a.m., here come more storms over the western part of the state. That is another system moving in with the front, and there is a level 1 marginal risk to level 2 slight risk across the area for damaging winds and hail. So here's how it plays out for tomorrow. They'll continue through 9 o'clock to 11 o'clock in the morning. Strongest storms down to the south. Alex City and Clanton with that slight risk is well. Watch out for you. And then the rain kind of tapers off by 4 o'clock as we head into Tuesday, but it'll be cooler. 87 degrees out there. Still stormy Wednesday, Thursday, Friday with a chance of strong and maybe a few pop-up severe thunderstorms. Highs will be in the lower 90s through the weekend and lows in the mid-70s.